Hello and welcome back to Let's Play State. Space Titan. Space Space Titan. No, a uh, Space Tyrant. So yeah, I'm actually curious of how this part will go. Artifact Award, Shining Scepter, increases tyranny for captured crystals. And Cloak of the Stars, plus one crystal. Huh. And Personal Transfer, plus two defense on controlled planets, and plus one card. Uh, but yes, this will be released on the... I think you said it was the 19th? Yeah, the 19th of uh, July. So yeah, if you feel like, uh, you know, getting it, then that's when it'll be released. This is interesting. I kind of like this. Uh, their main tagline is that you can conquer a galaxy on your lunch break, or conquer a game on your lunch break. So yeah, that's basically the premise behind it, is a lunch break tactical game. Or strategic game, I should say. Asteroid mining, plus 30% empire income capture. Unlocked by capturing two asteroids. Uh, unlocked after losing two. Oh, we have to lose two versus space monsters. Hmm. Destroy one space monster. Ah, uh, flagship, add dreadnought to your fleet. Unlocked after winning five flawless space battles. Wait, so I get to choose one of these to go in with? Your commanders start with plus one power charged in combat, or five, plus five starting tyranny. Oh, right, we get to, right, okay, my mistake, this is the things we get at the end, right. Have, having trouble invading? Equip an invasion artifact or bring something stuff. In monopolization missions, it is often better to oppress planets you own than expand why widely. Accomplish one of the following: conquer 17 planets and amass 1,400 credits. Hmm. Okay, so yeah, we need to actually keep this tyranny high enough that we don't end up losing because. If we get beneath this line, I believe, they start uh, getting upset at me. If it reaches zero, uh, blasting uh, ships and capturing worlds raises your tyranny over the second while unrest reduces it each turn. If you're, uh, if it reaches zero, your empire will rebel and you will lose. So yeah, we kind of need to keep on the warpath. Or do other things, but that's beside the point. Because there's no other way of doing it, right? It's just war. That's all there is. And it's also fill out this fleet of touch. Uh, yeah, I think I want to research as soon as possible. All of the strong will survive. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, tank takes. Plus 400 attack while your ship explodes. Stun an enemy for 20 seconds. Uh, I guess rate of fire decrease would be better. Ow! Please stop! Actually for now... We need to cut these numbers down. Holy! Goodbye ship! Ow! Right! Well... Mediocre. Yeah. Well, I. <clears throat> In a distant cell, you find a renowned bounty hunter locked away. He begs for your freedom. Will you grant it? Yes. Again, I will actually slide. Uh, okay. Yep. Right. What is this? 
Unrest. Ooh, minus two unrest. For now, we'll do that. I think. Yeah, that'll do it for now. Okay, so we only have the one right now, but that's fine. Uh, next turn we'll get uh, another ship. Titan Grip. Ah, we already have that one right now. Yeah, Just a upper to the for now. Shipyard. Let's get one of those other destroyers again. Ooh, what's this? What is this? Ah, uh, power unusable. Derelict power unusable? Okay. Relics of an ancient time. Forge worlds reduce ship production costs. Okay. So what did they say that we had to get again? Unlocked by capturing two asteroids. Okay. Two asteroids. Lose two battles to space monsters. Unlocked by f winning five flawless space missions. Or battles. Okay. Well, we need to capture two asteroids. That doesn't care to an asteroid. But alas, let's go there. Maybe going against things that are slightly too strong, actually. Well, what can you do? Uh... <laughs> Plus 400% attack! Our ship explodes! It's not an enemy for 20 seconds, we're just firing. I guess it's not an enemy for 20 seconds. Um... Damage. That is actually really mean. Oh god, that is mean. Excellent. As it should be. All hell and your valor. Stone hair is level two. Fleet size increased to ten ships. Excelente. Ah, uh, we need the crystals. Wow. Your advisors have demanded that this planet is a good. I uh, determined this planet is a good candidate for all improvements to experimental effects. Even hack the plant. <laughs> okay, sure. Hack the planet. Using the raw resources and might of your empire, this planet has been improved with special powers. Alchemy. Oh. Sweet. Uh, yeah, I'll do that, and then I'll put another one over here, possibly. It doesn't actually do damage on its own. I'll do that then and put, I can't put one of those there. Okay, I guess I'll put, oh, I'll put another friggin' destroyer on the board, I think. But that's next round. Uh, the Jade Fortress. Upgrading materials uh, greatly improve the survivability, 90 health, or Plasma Furnace. Uh, reactor upgrade vastly improves damage. Plus 15. Hmm. Sure. Plus 15 sounds good to me. Okay, so that was one uh, flawless victory. Nice. Fortifying.
allied with Senate. The Royal Guard adds one battleship to the fleet. What is a battleship? I don't think we have battleships. Come on. Let's try it out, I guess. Oh god, battleships are large, aren't they? Ha! Huh. Pulse beam, uh, burst an enemy ship. Uh, blast an enemy ship with two lasers. I like the looks of battleships. They're cool. We need slightly more firepower. No, actually, no, we do not. We do not at all need more firepower. <laughs> Well, fires every twelve seconds. Okay. Ah, uh, we can sell the surplus if we really wanted, but no, nah, that's good. Oh. Well, I guess we have no real option. No, well, that's unfortunate. <clears throat> well, let's go up here. Let's see what you've got. <laughs> Respite, make ship invulnerable for 15 seconds. That is nice. Uh, kill that ship. Just fly it all. <laughs> Just kill that ship. Okay, that was... We, we have a powerful fleet. We have one hell of a powerful fleet right now. Videos of proper submission procedures flood the net. Segments of the population of this world ascribe to a pacifist movement, which is at odds with the Imperial Doctrine. <laughs> oh, this pissed up. Yeah. Crushing taxation! The crushing tax is only f is fuel for the fire of peace. The whole planet adopts the religion. We got no defenses there, at all, ever. What's this? Military bases of the First Order of each barracks uh, grant an extra invasion die. What's this even do? I uh, use a uh, 15 turret eight to destroy one to three ships. enemy firing. Thornwall. Okay. That's quite a lot of ships over there. Hmm. May have to deal with that. Ah, uh, but anyway, how do we get new people? I guess we have to just kind of wait and see. Well, let's uh, shuffle on, I guess. Uh, do we want prison? I think we do. Uh, let's see. 
Command of the Galaxy's worst prisons are ideal for recruiting commander. That's where we need to go. Only the strong will survive. You will never be defeated. We will never be defeated. Mod rule all small short and smash All small ships do double damage, enemy shields. I guess I'll take Mod Rule. Not necessarily going to use it. I should have taken the other one. Uh. Okay, we need to get rid of you. Why am I regenerating? No! No! Don't do it! Kill it! Kill it! Oh, thank goodness. As it should be. No, please don't space me. Pew. <laughs> <laughs> Pew. I actually like that. That was good. Okay, come on. Uh oh, five. Some invading troops are executed for cowardice. Oh, really? Couldn't just get one more. Oh, that upsets me. Okay, fine. Uh, secret police. Tight grip. Uh, scapegoat. Then it's unreal, please. There we go. We'll do that. Drawn to the remote location by an unexplained force, you encounter a frog-like creature. You sense that it has become tired of this world and wishes to relocate. <laughs> this head looks good. Fate for Isaac Abomination. Ah, no, it takes some money. The Hypno frog, the frog is displeased with your quarters. For the next few days, all of your servants report severe headaches. But it stays up. Psionic. I wish it told me what this actually meant, though. Wait, where could I actually find out that means? Huh. Well, what can you do, I guess? Uh, I guess we'll have to take this and this. I'm still to actually use one of the things, I think. Uh. Ships. That that was perfect sense. Great. Yep. I destroy all fighters. Enemy ships are out. I make a ship invulnerable for 15 seconds. I guess 15 seconds of vulnerability is the best thing. Come on. Excellent. Uh, so, about this new government? Your advisors have determined that this planet is a good candidate for improvements and experimental effects. Hack the planet. Using raw resources and the mighty VR power, the planet has been improved with a special power. Oh. Permanently increase world upgrade. What output even? What? What? Sure, I guess. We'll do that. Uh, why not? I can't believe I've got another planet of this bloody pacifist. Can't believe I've got another bloody planet planet of pacifists. Uh. Jeez. Okay, so one more uh, perfect victory. That's all we need. Ah, we'll just end for now. Um, I think a few more shots per volley would be better. Ooh, landing party. 
allows an additional planetary exploration. Anyway, off we go. Let's see what you've got. Maybe we can talk this out? Do 50% damage with one ship? Yes. Uh, right off of that, we'll do it to that one. Then we'll kill that one outright. Start firing all volleys. Oh, it didn't actually kill that ship outright. Oh. There we go. Excellent. I need to try a boarding party at some point. Slaves should know their place. Stonehair is now level 3. Meteor Strike and now smashes two ships with asteroids. And fleet size increased by 15. Or 2, 15. <gasps> Adds one dreadnought to the fleet. Oh, yes, please. That's one. It's like my big, yeah, let's go and kill everything fleet. That's a slight issue. Uh, we're gonna have to fill out that line. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh well, what can you do? Okay, I might uh, get more frigates, I think. Oh my goodness, okay. Sure. Better than nothing. That's also a lot of shit, so let's go put it up like something like possible. Ha! Ha! Well, I just got rid of the most I could. Who needs power when you have numbers? Wait, why have I got so many? Okay, sure. So just spam an enemy ship for 30 seconds. Ah, 20 seconds would be nice. So that to you. Fire off all the volleys. What? Why did you... How did you... Oh, you've stunned that ship. Right? You're lovely. I shot... Metropolis is now level 2. Shocktopolis. Shocktopus. Shocktopus. Really? Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that is bad. Anyway, um. Made the planet. Really? Uh. Sure. Sure. Why not? Increase the amount of um, wealth we generate. Ah, uh, yeah, you can fortify that if you want. I don't care. I'll be there in a bit. Ooh. Add fast ability to your lab, to a lab you control. Fortunately, the only lab we have is this one, and it's kind of wonderful. I hope Fortify doesn't mean that it makes it impossible to capture, because that would be a pain in the ass. Unfortunately, we do kind of need to just get these. <laughs> we got another shot to boost, really. Deep inside a nearby nebula, your scouts find a tight cluster of gravimetric anomalies. Sensors cannot detect what may be inside them. Send in a ship. Inside the field, the ship discovers a remnant of an alien probe. Unable to bring it aboard, the ship uh, bring the ship out of the, 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 the. Unable to bring the ship out, the pilot manages to salvage some of the valuable equipment. Huh. Anyway, let's get some ships, shall we? Uh, we 
can plant you there, you can go there, and we'll get Carrier in the center. And we can't move you. Why am I trying to move you? That's a little bit foolish of me. Ah, uh, you move there, please. I might as well move this one forward and put this ship there. And we'll continue invading this. Or should I wait for the mid? Nah, we'll just pick it up. Sort it. <clears throat> really? Ugh. Well, let's get moving. The ramming enemy ships part sounds interesting. I think, yeah, I'll do that. Kamikaze units. Soon, soon. Titan grip. Ah, well, may as well. Why not, after all? Ah, uh, no. Don't invade with that fleet. What we'll do is we'll move you guys away. You guys move in. Invade. There you go. There you go. Right. Cool. <clears throat> Your advisors have determined that this planet's a good candidate for hack the planet. Using the raw resources and the might of your empire, the planet will be improved with a special power. Power. Permanently remove a single siege value for a free tech. What? Oh. Oh. No. Ah, uh, yeah, shipyard. Can I please get some more of these? Oh, dirt. I keep forgetting I can't move that fleet because I've already moved it. Why is the camera drifting over there? Camera? Camera? Where are you going? Where are you going? Um. Are you responding to the joystick? Can you? It is! Oh god, please stop! Uh, anyway, that is all we can do, so let's get moving. And experiment plus four research. Sure, why not? Ah, uh, but anyway, let's get you moving down here, please. You get moving here, and we get that. There we go. You move here. I said you move. I said you move. Hey, move there, then. Jeez. All oh, right, these are only one-way routes. Oh, okay, so when there's an arrow, it's a one-way route, and you can't go in a uh, direction. That's actually okay. Ha! Interesting, we can actually just recruit people. And increases volley size... Uh, it's harder... Increased volley size is harder for enemies to evade. Oh, okay. Regeneration fields? That sounds really awesome. Um, exploring a system, you can discover a hidden wormhole before you can take any action. Your fleet has pulled in. Oh. The wormhole spits you out in a location, then collapses behind you. Oh. Oh, goodness. I didn't want to be over here, but sure, why not? Why not? Okay, I've got a tiny little dice. 
Ah, uh, your advisors are determined that this planet is a good can candidate for improving experimental effects. Oh, high planet, yes. Using the raw resources, make your empire, blah 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 blah. of operations over here at least now. Um, slows enemy ships firing. Sacrificial healing. That's cool. Um, yeah, you know what? Sort of. Um, we won't move over there because we just finished it. Uh, had our time. Santa's getting quite a lot of planets here. <laughs> well, Titan Grip, I guess. Let's see what you've got. Forward into the greats, something or other, blah blah blah. blah, blah. Uh, destroy all faders, remove all effects from the friendly ships. Yes, destroy all faders. Geoblast, okay. Oh! It just. <laughs> it just vaporized me! Oh, okay. Pacifist asteroids. Should I invade? I'm curious, how many more have we got to go? Control 60% of the planets. Okay, so we have a few more to go. I'm trying to find where the asteroid planets are, because I do want to get that other achievement, so we need to go over there soon. Well, let's get a bit more of a little way, so to speak. Nothing discovered. Okay, that's fine. Add fast to that one, please. So we don't have any asteroids in this area right now. What if we make a way down here? Barracks? Okay. That'll give us more fortification. Ah, dice invasions, that's the word. Uh, where's the other fleet? Right, that other fleet's over there. Move you there. Um, no. I'll leave you. Whoa, what the... What the hell was that? No, seriously, what the hell was that? That was... That was funky. Uh, we don't control any more labs, do we? Er... I'm assuming we can't go double fast. Um, uh, well, let's go and see this planet down here. Over there. Only the strong will survive. Forward for our great leader. Uh, Armageddon destroys all but a handful of ships on each side. Ooh. Let's just get that one, shall we? Um, do you not take the ship that's about to explode? Oh, that is... that is painful! Back to the cloning vats! What 
Huh. That's the Senate home world, I guess. But anyway, I will leave it there, so until next time, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed.